to my channel. Welcome back to another video from Life with Tiffy. Today, guys, we're going to be coming in on a sneak peek, or maybe more than a sneak peek, of how I do my wash hair routine. Now, as you can see, my hair is all out, and right now it is extremely soft because I did a oil treatment earlier today, and now I'm about to go in with my routine how I go about washing my hair and I won't be treating my hair today because my hair has been in braids for the past three weeks and to be very honest I was not giving it the care and attention that it truly deserves and needs so I'm gonna be doing that today in this video so if you want to see how I go about washing my hair what's my routine then stay I have a few things that I'm gonna be using that I'm going to show you as the video progresses this may end up being a voiceover I don't know yet but if not I'm definitely gonna link down in the description all the products that I use to achieve my hair becoming clean, soft, manageable, the, the curls popping, everything. So guys, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you have not hit it already. Be sure to hit the thumbs up button and hit the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I upload a video. I want to thank you guys, all of those who have already subscribed and again I want to big up, big up, big up, big up, Miss Conceal for real. She said she wanted a shout out and Miss Conceal for real, big up myself. Thank you for watching my videos, thank you for staying true. And I'm going to wash, I'm washing my hair in the shower guys. So I'm just going to go ahead and sweat my hair up. So remember I told you guys that I was doing an oil treatment so you can see the oil coming down so which means I'm going to have to shampoo about three times to get rid of all the excess oil. So I'm using a Tresemme used by Professional, it's the anti-breakage, um, it says 80% less breakage, 5 vitamin blend. Yeah, then it's in French. So this is a um, shampoo that I use to shampoo my hair. Now onto my second shampoo. So I'm just going on in again with some shampoo to go through my hair. I really ended up only doing it twice. I didn't really need to do it three times because my hair wasn't as bad as I thought it would have been. And so what I do when I'm shampooing or I'm using a conditioner, I tend to just go in and give my scalp a good scratch, a good rub, a good massage to just get the follicles going to promote hair growth because I don't know about you. But your girl wants her hair to grow some more. Yes, look at that. Nice. God, my scalp is just loving this and appreciating all the goodness that it's getting. So time to wash it out. Mmm, voila. <laughs> I'm back and my hair is all washed out. All the shampoo is out. And I'm going to go in now. And yes, I'm just checking before I go in. I'm checking just to ensure that the, the scalp is clean. And my hair is clean and that we don't need another wash and I was I was okay with what I saw so I didn't bother to shampoo again so which is why I only did it twice good job so after my shampoo I go in with something else because my hair still needs more so I'm gonna go in with my aloe vera guys let me tell you something let me say sometimes things are good for you don't smell good and don't taste good that don't taste good so I'm just gonna go in section off my hair and I'm gonna be rubbing it in from end to root, roots to end. But then guys, mm -mm, I had some bumps going crazy on my forehead, so I decided to just rub some of the aloe vera on my skin because it is good for your skin. It really helps to tighten your skin and it gives your skin a nice glow and it helps like to clean up some of the bumps and rashes, rash that you may have on your body. I know other persons who have um, testified to it working. So sometimes to activate the aloe vera, I have to go in and use my fingers and just work it, work it like, I don't know, do, do it up to really get it going. And as you can see, that really woke it up because you can see that my hair is looking, looking sturdy and everything. 
Now time for my hair mask. And this is the Cream of Nature Pure Honey. Moisture, replenish, and strengthen. It's a hair mask for dry, damaged hair. And listen, my hair was dry and damaged. The texture is not too thick. It almost reminds me of peanut butter. Yes. So it smells divine. I love the smell of it. So, oh, I love did you guys just see the goo running from my hair? That's the aloe vera gel right there, guys. So I'm just going in with the hair mask. And again, I'm massaging it into my hair and my scalp. And then I'm going to go on and put on my steam cap. And I'm going to keep this on for approximately 15 minutes. That was quick, right? Mm, YouTube time. Look at my hair, guys. Tell me not see friends. Yes. So I'm just going in now with a big tooth comb to just comb out my hair to ensure that the product is spreading and distributing even, evenly throughout my hair and guys I'm telling you my hair was combing out so easily much easier than it would have had I not done all of this to my hair so it's going through and I love it I love the look I like the feel I wish I could allow you guys to feel it so I had some dead hair like everybody else does and I'm just getting rid of that now for my Baywatch moment don't judge me okay. <laughs> alright guys so time to condition my hair so I'm using the Tresemme conditioner it is the Tresemme used by professionals clean and replenish for lightweight moisture with vitamin C and green tea and I love this conditioner it makes my hair feel really nice and smell really nice too so I'm just going in to just distribute the product all over my head and then I'm just gonna go with my big tooth comb again and comb through just to ensure if there are any knots remaining that we get rid of those yes my curls are popping they're feeling good they're looking good just gonna comb it out that's the view from the back mm -hmm. oh la 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 nice clean hair so guys I went and I washed out all the conditioner now it's time for my leave-in conditioner it's the Shea Moisture Jama Jamaican Black Castor Oil strengthen and restore leave-in conditioner with shea butter peppermint and apple cider vinegar natural chemically processed or heat styled hair so I'm just gonna rub that in and then I'm gonna go and have my bath so I'll see you when I'm out alright so I used a t-shirt to just kind of dry out the excess water from my hair and my hair again I can't taste enough my hair feels so soft and nice so I'm just gonna go ahead now and um, twist it using some of the oils that you saw me using before and my hair moisturizer which I'll link down below so guys this is what I've done I've just gone ahead and twist my hair well, I'll tell you what I used to twist my hair but this is just gonna stay in until the dog yeah, this is going to stay in my hair until tomorrow morning when I pull it out. But that's my wash hair routine. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys will try it. And let me know if it works for your hair. If you find that your texture is nice. And, you know, if it's soft, if it's manageable after I finish. But I guess I want to thank you very much for tuning in today on today's video. Thank you very much for those who have subscribed. I want to say a big happy birthday to all my April celebrants. I'm going to do a good show to all my April people because this is my month too. So can not be shy. But I'm going to do something special for you guys soon. So guys, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. And always remember and never forget, tell a friend to tell a friend to tell all them friends. Subscribe to Life with Tiffy. Bye, y'all. Enjoy yourselves. Be safe.